escríbanos eh, acá en los comentarios, escríbanos un saludo, say hi to us, and today's topic, I'm very glad that it is um, what we do best, which is, oh, sorry, which is talking about our idioms, oh, oh my gosh, I, I swear I opened it before, but okay, yeah, so today we're talking about uh, most common Spanish idioms for conversations, for daily conversations, and we have a lot of them, and we want we want to share them with you and actually actually like like i really uh, recommend you to stay and um to pay lots of attention for the first uh, the first topic we have and well anyway please say hello to us por favor escríbanos ahí en facebook pero también en youtube estamos listos para recibirlos y por supuesto, eh, bueno, ya los estamos viendo en pantalla. Mi nombre es Efra. Y yo soy Diego, chicos. That was the perfect timing, man. That was the perfect, perfect, perfect timing. Perfect timing. Ok. Um, to do what? <laughs> no, here to the, for the presentation. Ok, ok. So, uh, yeah, this is what we do best. This is what we enjoy the most. Uh, basically, the most common Spanish idioms for yeah, daily talking conversations. About idioms is our... That's what you do best, man. Yeah. That's what you do best. Es lo que, lo que más nos gusta también hacer. So, why don't we start uh, here with some um, greetings. Ajá. Uh -huh. Entonces, tenemos por supuesto a nuestro gran amigo John R. Muchísimas gracias, John. So, should we switch? Uh, okay, you want to switch? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we can definitely switch. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's because it's more comfortable. Though, like, it's uh, more comfortable to read yeah. here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is because today we have the table here. That's why. So, uh, Eric Sonder aquí está con nosotros. Muchas gracias, Eric, por todo el apoyo. Lía, también a ti. Un enorme, gracias enorme, a enorme Eric. saludo. A Lía por siempre su apoyo de ambos. Muchísimas gracias. Mira, Cocoa dice, soy Dora. Hola, Cocoa. Cocoa, oh, Dora. Should I say Dora? Hola, Dora. Dora. Uh, Sonia, hola a todos. Hola, Sonia, qué bueno que hola, estás Sonia. aquí. Hola, Sonia. Lexi, qué onda, mi gente, mira. Qué chido que estés Lexi. aquí, Lexi. Qué bueno. Mira quién apareció, el príncipe Río. Ahí anda. Ah, ahí anda, anda ahí el anda. río. Ahora sí anda. Hola, muchachos. Qué gusto verlos. El gusto es todo nuestro, príncipe Río. Qué bueno. David Park. Hola a todos. Hola, David. Muchas gracias. María, gracias. Hace mucho que no la veíamos. A María, saludos a María. Está Il Padrino, por supuesto. Easy the Great. Hola a todos. Eh, Ki G. Hola. Um, tenemos a Antonio Reyes, por KG, supuesto. No, KG. Ah, no, sí, KG. No, dice Kille. Kille, saludos, Kille. saludos. Y también tenemos a Chanel DK, que te puso muchos corazoncitos, Efra. ¿A mí o a ti? <risa> a ti. <risa> Todos los corazones y besos son para ti. A mí oh, nunca gracias, me mandan nada. Gracias. Uh, y Biona Wiranti, hola, hola. Biona, muchísimas gracias por estar aquí con nosotros. Sí, sí. Y pues bueno, um, say Ahí also kind here. No, no, no. No, we're not here on YouTube. Um, Facebook. Yeah, on, on, no, on ponle, Facebook. click on en vivo. Yeah, but well, we're not there yet. I don't know, for some reason. Uh, well, if you are watching us through Facebook, uh, thank you. Um, <laughs> Muchas gracias. Yeah, and I hope we are not freezing. Everything is right. Uh, can you hear us well? No, mm -hmm. we're not breaking up. Yep. Okay. So, here's, the, <laughs> here's the keyword. <laughs> okay, so, I can't. Oh, it's in the other one. Yeah, it's yeah. fine, it's fine. No, 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 no. Here. You're clicking the... Okay. Okay, guys. So, we just want to remind you <laughs> that you can get our free PDF cheat sheet. Put it in here. <laughs> in SpanishPod101.com slash learn dash with dash PDF. Mm -hmm. There you can find very useful vocabulary for your, for daily use. Uh -huh. Such as time, uh, how to talk online, uh, making friends, sports, and many other topics. This is yeah. totally for free, guys. The only thing you need to do is click on the link down below or if, if you are on Facebook here next to Efra. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. So, okay. 
First section. Our first trip to sound like Mexican. Our first tip. Ah, uh, our <laughs> I thought it was trip. Our first tip to sound like a Mexican. So if you want to sound like a Mexican, follow these steps. Yeah, did you hear that when when I was surprised about Rio, I said like um ahí anda, ahí anda. Mm -hmm. Is he there? No, ahí está. Okay, okay, let let me let me explain this to you. So maybe you already know this verb andar as a synonym of caminar. No, yo ando. Yo camino. It is also used for two wheel ve vehicles. Um, yeah, for example, me gusta andar en bici. Mm. Me gusta andar en bici, ¿no? Is that mm -hmm. true? ¿Te gusta andar en bici? Y, sí, sí, me gusta mucho. ¿Sí? Eh, more than cars, me gusta. Really? Sí, me gusta más que los carros. Well, to say actually andar a caballo. Andar a caballo. Mm -hmm. Andar en moto. Mm -hmm. Very good. Andar a pie. <laughs> sí, también. Like andar, a go, pie. andar a pie is just like uh, by, by foot. By foot. Yeah, by yeah, foot. Yeah. Andar a pie. Andar a pie. Uh -huh. Todos los días ando en moto, for example, every day I ride a motors, motorcycle, no? But you can also change the verb estar for andar. Yeah, yes, in Mexican and Spanish, they are interchangeable. Mm. Like they are. I don't know, maybe in other countries too, but at least in Mexico, we use this one a lot. And that's actually pretty common. Pretty, pretty common. Pretty common. Like I said, um, anda ahí. Uh, ahí anda. Mm -hmm. Ahí está. Yeah. So, for example, ¿cómo estás? You can say, ¿cómo andas? Mm -hmm. Like, write this down. Like, <laughs> if I were you, I would write in this one. Yeah, the first thing you ask to someone is, hola, ¿cómo estás? So, if you want some more Mexican, hola, ¿cómo andas? ¿Cómo andas? Mm -hmm. And that's awesome. Yeah. Okay. For another example, ¿dónde está Carlos? You can uh, change the, the verb estar for andar. And ¿Dónde anda Carlos. Okay. And if you want to be even more Mexican, ¿dónde anda el Carlos? ¿Dónde anda el Carlos? You can <laughs> add an article. No, don't, don't use the article. It's it's just uh, between us. Uh, don't use the article, but yes, indeed, it's well, more Mexican. Well, it's just that it is more Mexican. Is more Mexican. If you add the article to a name, like, ¿dónde anda la Lía? Ajá, ¿dónde anda la Lía? Mira, ahí anda la Lía. La, ajá. Uh, and actually, for example, in, in Greek, they always have the article. Oh, yeah? Before the name? Melene Tonefra. Uh-huh. Wow. That's yeah. crazy. Well, anyways. Okay. So, for example, we can also say, Carlos, Carlos está en el trabajo. Carlos está en el trabajo or just changing. Yeah. Carlos anda en el trabajo. ¿Dónde anda Carlos? Él anda en el trabajo. Anda en el trabajo. Uh -huh. Very good. Or... Yeah, you can use it also for perifrasis verbales. Carlos está jugando fútbol. Mm -hmm. Carlos está jugando fútbol. Carlos anda jugando fútbol. Carlos is playing soccer. Exactly. Esto entonces es la perifrasis verbal de estar más gerundio. So mm -hmm. you might already know it, like, ¿qué estás haciendo? Ah, pues estoy viendo mi serie favorita, uh -huh. estoy eh, bañándome, estoy cantando, estoy whatever. Instead of using estoy, ando. Ando. Mm -hmm. Ando viendo mi serie favorita, ando, ¿Sí? eh, me ando bañando, etcétera, etcétera. <laughs> Me ando pañando. ¿Qué vas a decir? Me ando no, no. <laughs> Okay. No. Uh, yeah, yeah, like, how do you say I, I need to pee in informal Spanish? Miarse. Uh, like that verb in reflexive, me ando miando. Like, me ando miando. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Well, okay. Ah, okay. Or, or, estoy triste. Estoy triste. Estoy triste porque solo hay ahorita 22 personas viéndonos. Estoy triste. Ah, oh, well. That, that's good. That's they good. will that's... watch us off. No, ok. Ahí anda un video nuestro nuevo. Uh, how to talk about money in mm -hmm. Spanish. Mm -hmm. um, Especially we include a Mexican Spanish uh -huh. word. Mm -hmm. Sí, sí, sí. Like feria. Ando triste, ando triste. Instead of estoy triste. Okay. Let's go to this one and that's some alternatives to say me gusta because you probably know what is me gusta but what alternatives you want if you want to sound a bit more Mexican you can say. So yeah. 
First of all, if you like someone, don't say me gusta. For example, me gustas, I like you. Uh, like, unless it is like um, for something romantic. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. If you like someone as a friend, say me cae bien. For example, me cae bien Carlos. I like Carlos. Yeah, very good. Me cae bien Carlos. Don't say me gusta. That's super common. Like, me gusta. That's a very common mistake. And yeah. when you are with someone, it's like, oye, es que me gustas. I and like you're like, oh. ay, ay, ay. Well, la verdad es que tú también me gustas. Sí, te presento a mi novia. You'll be like, what? Yeah. What I, happened here? This is my husband. My husband That's, here. Yeah, okay. exactly. This is my husband. <laughs> and, uh, but you just said <laughs> you like me. Yeah, I, I, she, she's really like, yes, I like you. But you know, as, as my friend, uh, yeah. Be like, yeah. If you don't want to be confused about this, use and stick to um, me cae bien for or friends. Or me caes bien when it is to me caes. When it is personal. Mm -hmm. Me caes bien. So me caes bien. Me uh -huh. caes bien. <laughs> me cae bien. Me caen. Because these are plural. Remember that uh, caer in this case works as gustar. If it is, if it is singular, me gusta la pizza. No? If it is plural, me gustan, with n, las manzanas. It's, it is the same with caer. Me caen, because it's plural. Rodrigo, me caen bien Rodrigo y Ricardo. I like Rodrigo and Ricardo. Perfect. Okay, vamos al siguiente. Now, if you feel attracted to someone, like, write this down, guys. <laughs> write this down. Okay, if you feel attracted to someone, you say, me gusta María. You mm -hmm. finally can say, me gusta María. Mm -hmm. Me gusta María. Perfect. Well, like, I like Mary. I feel attracted to her. Or, you can also say, mm -hmm. me flechó, me flechó María. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So, I really like Mary. Me flechó. And this comes from, uh, actually, since we are getting closer to San Valentine's Day, uh, you know, San Valentin tiene un arco con una flecha, a mm -hmm. narrow. Mm -hmm. So that's where it comes, uh, this verb from. Me flechó, me, me flechó. flechó. It's like, me flechó María. Mm -hmm. Me flechó María. And uh, synonyms, let's see some synonyms of me gusta. Finally. Mm -hmm. So the first one is me agrada. Me agrada. Me agrada. Me agrada el libro Inmersión. Sí. Me agrada el libro Inmersión. I can't remember the author, but it, it's, it is about sharks. Sharks? Mm -hmm. Well, an art, but also sharks, like the... Sharks and art. Yeah, I can't tell why sharks, because I would tell you, like, the plot, but... <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> okay, <laughs> the next one. Me late tu playera. Hmm. Me late tu playera. Me late tu playera. Uh-huh. I, I really liked your t-shirt and latte comes from latir. Like your, your t-shirt makes my heart beat. I <laughs> like that. Yeah, yeah very good. Late. Me late. So, uh, let's learn now some different ways to say maybe, maybe. maybe. So, the, no, the most common way to say maybe is uh, tal vez. Tal vez. Let's see. So, we, we, we have these synonyms for you guys. So we have tal vez, capaz que, mm -hmm. that's very Mexican by the way. Capaz que, iguali, which is also very used here, iguali, uh -huh. a lo mejor, and finally, chance y. So write this down guys, we, uh, this is the only live stream that we will do uh, regarding these very useful phrases. Uh -huh. uh, so make sure to write them down. So instead of just saying tal vez, also use capaz que, igual y, a lo mejor, or chance y. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, for example, oye, no ha llegado mi novia del trabajo, ¿dónde está? Eh, capaz y, y está tomando un café. Capaz que. Capaz que está tomando. <laughs> igual y, capaz que. <laughs> igual y está tomando un café, capaz que está tomando un café. A lo mejor está A tomando. A lo mejor está tomando un café. Ya. Yeah. Chance y está tomando un café. Ya. Yeah. You know how I know them all? It's because we have them in this second screen. Ah. Yeah, right there. Okay. Very good. Okay. So now we have capaz que quiere un tiempo a solas. Es que no me, no me oh. contesta Fanny. 
like you were asking yeah, me exactly. to answer. It's, it, doesn't, it doesn't matter. Es que no me contesta Fanny. Bueno, capaz que quiere un tiempo a solas. Capaz que quiere un tiempo a solas. Yeah, so maybe uh, he or, or she wants uh, some alone time, uh -huh. right? Maybe he or she. Uh -huh. Oh, another, another one. Igual y perdió su celular. Mm -hmm. Maybe he or she lost her cell phone. Mm -hmm. Igual y perdió su celular. Igual y. Perdió Maybe. Su celular. Ajá. Muy bien. Or. A lo mejor está un poco molesto. Mm, Carlos yeah. no contesta. Carlos, Carlos no, no contesta. contesta. A lo mejor está un poco molesto. ¿Qué? Yeah. A lo mejor. A lo mejor está so un poco molesto. A lo mejor es just also in, in Argentina. Ya, yeah. a lo mejor. Ya, yeah, I know a banda song with this, a lo mejor. It's called like that, just a, a lo, lo mejor. mejor. Ya, yeah, a lo mejor. So, or chance y pensaron que tu cumple era mañana, like, <laughs> like can I, can I tell the, anec the anecdote? Like, ah, yes. Once we had a party because it was a friend's birthday. Ajá, uh -huh, we had a party. basically, he just had in the party one person. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we invited everyone to my party yeah. and just one person came. Yeah, but, but then I said to Efra, mira, eh, chance. chance y pensaron que tu cumple era mañana. Maybe they thought your birthday was yesterday, was tomorrow. You know? Yeah, but we had a good time. Yeah, yeah. and also the, the most recent birthday I had, uh, four of them ca came. This yeah, time. it was three more, right? it's, uh, uh, it's, it's improving. More, it's, uh, yeah, it's... More. With four, it was super okay. It was, uh, it, it's getting better. Yeah, it's getting better. I'm foreigners, right? Eh? Most of them were oh, foreigners. Oh, well, no? half of them were foreigners. Like four of them were foreigners and the other the other part were my family. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah which well. is cool, okay. So, oh, tal vez voy, tal vez voy a Estados Unidos en marzo. Tal vez voy a Estados Unidos en marzo. Yo tal vez voy, ¿eh? Ah, ¿ya? Yeah? Yeah. Voy a visitar a mi chiquistriquis. Are you going to leave me here alone? <laughs> nah, just kidding. Ok, ok. So, um, oh, ok, we want to encourage you to get your free PDF cheat sheets. You can have them now and they are going to be for free. Also, you will get your free lifetime account in the link down there or right there. You will just write your email and then you will receive a confirmation email and well, after that you just click on it and you will have access to all of them. So join this community now uh, and get them for free. Print them, save them, you can keep keep them with you. Yeah, Good. and that's it. Thank you. So, let's check the verb importar in daily conversations. The verb importar. Este verbo es importante. So, for example, how do you say in Spanish, oh, never mind. So, sometimes you just want uh, the other person to forget what he was saying. Like, oh, okay, never mind. Uh, never mind. So, in Spanish, we say, ah, no importa. No importa. Hey, we didn't, no importa. Read, we didn't read comments. Oh, actually, I was going to read okay. some comments right now. No so, importa. Never no mind. Importa. Okay, no, no importa. Mira, dice Río, ya sin chamarra salen los músculos, señor pizza. Mira, mira, mira ahí está. Ay, ahí está. papá. It's getting better. Eh, Marisol, hola chicos, hola Marisol. Marisol. Hope still there. Muchas gracias. Um, eh, pa, 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 pa. Mi, marido di mi marido dice, I am playing Monster Hunter Rise, uh, los videojuegos. Uh, do you like video games, Ebra? Mm, I like them, but I don't play any. I haven't played any of them in years, like in, at least eight or seven. Oh, likewise. Yeah. David Johnson, hola, ¿cómo están todos? Hola, David, muy bien, muchísimas gracias. ¿Cómo andan? Todos? ¿Cómo andan? Yeah, that's the, that's the correct way. ¿Cómo andan? <laughs> me gusta la mañana, me gustas tú, el río. Me gusta la... <laughs> me gusta comer, me gustas tú. Yeah, very good. Ah, she knows, she knows. <laughs> Leah. <laughs> uh, look, uh, Sharks and Art, gotta to check that book. Yeah, I, I, I knew you were going to say that, Leah. You, it's, it's a really good book. <laughs> Muy bien, muy bien, muy bien, very good. Uh, oh, Efra, we've come 
to your birthday. Ah, you will come, that's great. All the way from Japan to Mexico just for yeah. your birthday. Yeah? We're gonna have fun because um, <laughs> it's not only the birthday, we go out every day after that and uh, yeah. Va a haber payaso? Like a whole week doing that. No, there won't be clowns. Oh, <laughs> no, I won't come. I but then we will have piñatas. Yeah. We Very had good. piñata that time, that time? No, we didn't. But, but we, we had piñas coladas. We had piñas coladas and lots of alcohol. A lot of, yeah. <laughs> You're really a lot because we yeah. were expecting like 50 people. Yeah, we were expecting more, so we vote a lot. Okay, okay. so more synonyms. Más uh, synonymos. So we say, uh, apart from no importa, never mind, uh, we also say X. X. Just like, like that. Like, Leah, if you want to learn something new today, it will be X. 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 Or... Da igual. Da igual. Also, X is like um, something not important. Like, um, sí, era una persona muy X. Mm -hmm. like no a, importante. A person which is not very important, una persona X. Uh, yeah, very uh -huh. good. Okay. Uh, or just uh, no me importa. No me importa. No me importa. That's no me importa. I don't care. Okay. Don't no care. me importa. I don't care. That's how we say. <laughs> like, si dos X lager. <laughs> so synonyms of no me importa. Uh, yeah, it's funny because it's true. Okay, me vale. Me vale. If you want to say no me importa in a Mexican way, you can also say me vale. Me vale. Just me vale. Me vale. Or me importa un bledo. Me importa un bledo. Some people even say, me importa un cacahuate. Me importa un cacahuate. Yeah. And we're not going to teach you the other ways to say, no me importa. No, we don't. No. That's because in not... English, for example, you have a bad word like, I don't give a... <laughs> we have something like that in Spanish, but we are not teaching you that. This is a family friendly channel, guys. Uh -huh. And we just want to make sure that you have the standard that you yeah. can say to your friends. Like anyone, anyone. Well, yeah. me importa un pledo. You wouldn't say that to your boss. I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> More <laughs> like, <laughs> quiero ese reporte para hoy. <laughs> Me importa un bledo. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like common sense. You wouldn't say yeah, that. You wouldn't say it. But you, uh, then again, you will not say me vale, right? Me vale. <laughs> yeah, okay. I love me vale. Uh, okay. Oye, <clears throat> ¿quieres salir conmigo? Hey, do you want to go out with me? Uh, mm -hmm. On a, a date? date. On a date. ¿Cómo? Sorry. Hay X. Hay X. Ah, uh, X. Uh, yeah, uh, never mind. Yeah, uh, X. X. Never mind. Like, can you know? Like, I said it like, ah, <laughs> X. Yeah, ah, X. And you yeah. just sounded like a like super, ah, uh, X. Yeah, like uh, you're uh, super confident. Ah, uh, X. Ah, uh, X. Yeah. Okay. Ah, uh, no escuché. Perdón. No escuché. Perdón. I couldn't hear. Sorry. No me importa. <laughs> no me importa. Hmm, okay. <laughs> I don't care. Okay. So uh, now, how to say that everything's ruined? Because yeah, yeah things go can go south and things can be ruined. Or right? how do you say it's done? There are there are more options. Like it's done. It's exactly. How do you say forget that? it? It's done. Uh huh. Well, the first one we have is. Olvídalo. Ya valió. Forget it. it everything is ruined. Mm -hmm. Ya valió, but um, in some other languages you don't use it a lot, you don't say it a lot, but in at least in Mexico we say it every time, like ya valió. Ya valió. Like, I get a, I, I didn't approve my exam. Uh -huh. Ooh, ya valió. Ya valió. Yeah. It's done. Everything is green. No? Very good. Or, <laughs> there is another one that sounds like, like ya valió, and it is ya bailó, like it danced. <laughs> it danced, but it's because it sounds super similar to ya bailió, ya valió. Yeah, it, does, it doesn't have anything to do with a dance, no, uh -huh. just because it sounds like valió, uh -huh. so ya bailó. Ya bailó. Yeah, very good. Or, ya chafió, ya chafió. Yeah. Everything, like if you go out on a party and then your mom is calling you because she, she didn't find you at home. Ooh, ya chafió. Ya chafió. Yeah, and it comes from, from chafa, from chafa actually, and chafa is uh, something low. of low quality. Low quality. Low quality, okay, that's chafa. Ya valió. Another one, when you are, you told your girlfriend you are, uh, you are in the house, 
and then she finds out that he, that I'm out that on a vacation ya, ya to Arabia Saudita. Ya valió. Uh, ya valió. Ya Or valió. Like when, uh, when you are flirting with someone and that girl tells you you have a girlfriend. Ya valió. Nah, I yeah. will tell your girlfriend. <laughs> oh, yeah, in that case, ya bailó. <laughs> ya bailó. Yeah. Oh, uh, la maestra sabe que copiaste en el examen. La maestra sabe que copiaste en el examen. The teacher knows that you cheated on the exam. Uh, ya bailó. Ya bailó. Ya bailó. Okay, guys. Uh, Rio has another Another way to say it, ya valió Berta, ya bailó Berta. Ya bailó Berta, yeah, that's correct, And that's correct. We didn't include that one because it sounds like the bad word, like. This one is uh, kind of family yeah. friendly, of course. Uh, ya bailó Berta, but just stick to that, don't say the bad words. Yeah, there are more bad words, more, but there are uh, more informal ways to say ya valió. Huh? So very good. Uh, X like dos X. Like I, I love I love the comment. Lol. I love the comment. Uh, very good. Uh, X my word of the day. Yes, note it down, Leah. Note it down. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Um, when everything is ruined, I go with ya está o se fue. Ya está se fue. Yeah. Ya está se fue. Ya está se fue. Okay. Very good, guys. So. Wait, let's start with the summary and the quiz. Ah. Uh, first, our first tip to sound like a uh, Mexican. Yeah. That is, uh, use <clears throat> andar instead of estar. They are synonyms in Mexican Spanish. So, estar, mm -hmm. replace it with andar. Uh -huh. andar. Um, we check some alternatives to the verb me gusta. First of all, if you are not interested in someone and you want to say I like you, me caes bien, me caes bien. Yeah. Huh? Then we talked about me late, me laten y me flecho. Very good. Uh, uh, we also learned some different ways to say maybe. Que, tal vez. Capaz que. Capaz que. Uh, igual y. Igual y. Chance y. A lo mejor. Ajá, y a lo mejor. Ajá. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> okay, the next one is the verb importar in daily conversation. So remember that we, uh, you can say never mind as no importa. No importa. But we also check uh, other ways. Me vale. Mm -hmm. Y X. And X. X. Never mind, no? X. And how to say everything's green in, in Spanish. Ya bailó. Mm -hmm. uh, sorry, ya valió. Ya bailó. And. Ya está, se ya fue. Está, se fue. <laughs> yeah, very okay, good. how can you translate these phrases? Please help us to translate these phrases. Dalia, the singer won't come. Everything's ruined. Si soy un bad boy. Dalia, the singer won't come. Everything's ruined. We don't have anything on Facebook. Nope. For some reason. Let's see, no. let's see. Um, oh, it's it's just that it's there in este momento. It says in este momento. Yeah, but it's not for some. Oh, yeah, here. There you. There we are. Here we are. Oh, we just have a Sky Schuler. Sky, saludos. Thank you, Sky. Yeah, but it wasn't not like in the in the homepage for some oh, reason. As homepage. always. Yeah. Well, anyways, I will so, share it at the end. Let's check here on YouTube. Uh, pa -pa -pa -pa. Come on, Lexi, try. Come on, Rio, you got this. You got this. Leah, come on, help us here. Dalia, the singer won't come. Everything is ruined. Where is Cody? Where is Cody? Yeah, where is Cody? Dalia, la cantante no viene. Todo ya chafeó, okay? Uh -huh, ya chafeó. <laughs> ya chafeó, yeah, uh -huh. I like it. La cantante, <ríe> me gusta, la cantante, la cantante Dalia no va a venir, la tristeza lo arruinó todo, ¿verdad? ¡Ay! ¿Verdad? ¿Cómo? <ríe> ¿Cómo? <ríe> <¡Lía>! <ríe> no llegará Dalia la cantante, ya valió. Very good, Oye, very good. Ya bailó Berta también. Ya bailó Berta. Ya good. bailó, ya bailó. Ok, no va a venir, ya valió. Very good. Ok. Now what about this one? Maybe she lost her phone. Maybe she lost her phone. Oh, but yeah. but but first, how did she let uh, let us 
let them know that she wouldn't come. Hmm. Well, we don't know. Maybe, Maybe. she lost her phone. She lost her phone. Uh. There is no link for the cheat sheet. Um. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, the link is to assess your Spanish. It's to assess your your Spanish, actually. Uh. uh yeah, guys. Or, sorry for some reason. It's to assess your Spanish, which is even really good because you can yeah. have it for free, right? Yeah, and you can assess your level. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're sorry, guys. It was actually the link for the assessment. We are truly sorry. Yeah. Uh, my okay. bad, my bad. Pa, pa, pa. And Diego's bad, too. Capaz que perdió su celular de John R. Very good. Very ya, good. Ba ya bailó. Uh, ya Rio, bailó. capaz que perdió su celular. Very good. Very good. Uh -huh. uh, Nikki, hi, Nikki. How are you? Um, yeah, excellent, guys. A very intelligent audience. A ver, en Facebook, salúdenos, por favor. Capaz que perdió, o capaz y, yeah, sometimes capaz you can perdió su celular. change it. Capaz que, o capaz y, uh, perdió su celular. And what about this one? I was calling to invite you out to dinner, but never mind. <laughs> but never mind. Never but mind. never mind. Okay, guys. You got this. Quizás perdió su celu, sí. Quizás perdió su celu. Su celu, su celu. It's too late. right here. How do you say never mind in Spanish? Uh, never mind. Um, I don't know. You guys have to tell me. Did you pay attention? Lexi, you should tell me. Sonia. Yeah, where, where are you, Sonia? Come Maria, on, type in. Maria. Maria Grazia, come on. Hopefully Maria. you're still there, Maria. So tell us, tell us. In the meantime, guys, I just want to remind you that we have a new video here in Spanish yep. Pop. It's really useful. That's for vocabulary and how to talk about money. Uh, we're pretty sure that you didn't know that uh, in Mexico we call money feria. And sometimes we even call it luz. Yeah, how to say I owe the bank. Yeah, I have a debt. Exactly, like uh, even vocabulary, vocabulary very useful. So uh, make sure to check it out. Mm -hmm. uh, very good. So pa pa pa. Te estaba llamando para invitarte a cenar, pero nada se fue. <laughs> pero nada. Pero nada. Pero nada se fue. Te llamé para invitarte a cenar, pero x. Okay, very good, John. Uh, very good, excellent. Eso. Yeah, yeah. Te llamaba para invitarte a cenar, pero ya me vale. Oh, mira, ay, mira. Ya me vale. Ya me vale. Ya me vale. Me very good, very good. Te estaba llamando para invitarte a comer, pero X. Bien. Pero, pero X. XX Lager. Pero ah, <laughs> XX Lager. Okay, guys, very quickly. Okay, um, so. Actually, we just want to tell you um, not about the cheat sheets that you already know, but rather that if you want to take uh, an assessment for free, to know your current level, especially mm -hmm. if you are learning on your own and you are wondering where uh, you are in A1, A2, uh -huh. B1, B2, or probably C1, hopefully, um, you can take this assessment for free in the link down below. Mm -hmm. And uh, also, you can, after you create your account, you have access to our free PDF so, cheat sheets. Okay. And it is a lifetime account. Very good. Okay. So guys, uh, next uh, live stream is going to be about useful Spanish phrases to keep conversations going on. Mm. So something like, ¿Y después qué pasó? Mm. Cuéntame más, tell me more. No? Very good. Uh, sí, sí, sí. Uh, ¿Sabías que? Did you know that? Um, exactly. That. So if you don't want to feel stuck on not knowing what to say to continue the conversation, don't yeah. worry, we've got your back. We are going, we are giving you some advice. Sí, sí, sí. Uh, thank you guys. Muchísimas gracias a todos por estar aquí. Les mandamos un enorme beso y un enorme abrazo. Muchísimas, muchísimas gracias. 
Y eh, hasta la próxima. Hasta la próxima y queremos leer unos mensajes antes, Diego. Yes, that's true. <risa> Ay, no manches. Uh, Nos pasamos por cinco minutos. Ah, uh, yeah, th there were just the answers. Uh, I need that in English as well as Spanish. The Amber Atlantis. Ok. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Bueno. Nos vemos, nos <laughs> vemos in every language. Lia, nos vemos, muchas gracias. Amber, Lexi.